the, the, the guy there in the middle, the, the, the black guy in the middle. Yes, yes, you, sir. Oh, that's racist. Was that racist? Is it racist to refer to a black gentleman as black? I think Fiona Bruce had to apologise for what she said there. And some people are very paranoid about coming across as racist. I got into this debate on Twitter, by the way. And if you would like to, please follow me on Twitter. It's Lessons for Life 247. That's the uh, Twitter handle. Put that at in, obviously. And I got into this discussion with a guy who was saying, yeah, it was racist. You wouldn't say that about a white person. You wouldn't refer to the white gentleman. Uh, it's unfair that the black man is singled out or this is somehow something only reserved for black people. I don't think it is. I think as we're living in a more diverse society or in more diverse parts of the world, parts of the country, people are more comfortable with referring to each other by their race or their ethnicity. And no offence is intended and no offence is really taken. And if you tiptoe around the concept of race, you can come across as someone who is paranoid about coming across as racist. Maybe because you secretly are. So I think Fiona Bruce did quite well there to logically, obviously, uh, mention the, the black gentleman in the middle. That's the most noticeable thing about a person. There's nothing negative about being any particular race. So why do we uh, dance around it? I'm sure you remember this piece of commentary from Joe Rogan. Short black trunks for Jones, white trunks for Guzmao. Or black guy Jones, white guy Guzmao. That was said by Joe Rogan. <laughs> so if you are genuinely not racist and you have genuinely nothing to hide, I don't think there's any problem with referring to somebody or describing them uh, by their ethnic group. And perhaps there is a point that we should be equal across the board. And if you're going to describe black men as black men, you describe white men as white men. The fact is, the UK is a majority white country, so being black is more likely to be a distinguishing characteristic than being white. But if in that audience there'd been one white gentleman sat in the middle of black people or people of another ethnic group, then it would have been an obvious way to describe him by saying, oh yeah, the uh, white gentleman in the middle. And I think Fiona Bruce uh, had no intention of being racist and I think it's a shame that she had to apologise.